How's it going, everyone? Welcome to Series 23, Beach Party, Autumn in Forza Horizon 5. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Forgathon Weekly Challenge, Summer Shelby. Chapter 1 is Colorful Contender. Own and drive the 2013 Ford Shelby GT500, a chic, strong car which boasts eight distinct colors to choose from. For this, all you're going to want to do is own this car. It's available in the Auto Show for 115,000 credits. And if you're really lucky, you could also find it in the Auction House for less than that. This is the cheapest I've found, but the majority of them were posted up for 101,000 credits. Whichever way you purchase it, or even if you already have it, all you gotta do is hop in this car and drive it. And that brings us to Chapter 2, which is Unmatched. With Ford claiming that the 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 has the highest horsepower engine produced in North America to date, it's best to put that to the test by winning a road race. Now for this, you're just gonna wanna start any road race. You don't wanna blueprint it as that will sometimes bug the events. I have a couple of tunes down in the description below. They are marked to say what the tune is for. So no matter which class you prefer to take this in, whether it's A class or S1 class, or if you just wanna bring it in stock, either way it will be fine. If you're having winning, you can always just lower the difficulty of your driver tars. Please don't forget to drop a like on the video if it helped you out, and subscribe with notifications on if you want to see more content like this. I do seasonal PR stunt guides, which began going live 30 minutes prior to season change over each week, and I'm also working on PR stunt guides for all the PR stunts in the game, which will include the expansions as well. I'm also streaming Thursdays around noon Central Standard Time, and Wednesdays about the same time. For playlist completion, we do the whole playlist both times, we run it all the way through on different accounts on my side, that way we make sure we are doing the whole thing. And sometimes on Wednesdays we have some time left over at the end for some fun stuff. Yesterday for instance, if you're watching this when it goes live on Thursday, we did do the Icons of Speed story after the stream. It's an open lobby and everybody is welcome. If you're wondering which of the tunes down in the description below I am using, it is the one listed first at the very top. That's going to bring us to Chapter 3, which is Shelby Speeding Through. The 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 has a 0 to 60 mile per hour acceleration time of 3.5 seconds and can reach up to 200 mile an hour. See this in action by earning 5 awesome speed skills. Now for this, you're just going to want to go to any straight stretch of road. My preferred location is the highway. Now this is going to be a little bit faster to do in some of the other tunes down in the description below, specifically the S1 class tunes because to get an awesome speed skill, you have to be going at least 175 miles an hour. That is right at the top end of the range of the A-Class tune that's at the very top, as you'll see soon. It does get it done, but you have to make sure you uh, kind of careful on turning and that you don't hit any traffic cars, especially don't hit any traffic cars. The other tunes down there will easily be able to do this though. And there's our awesome speed skills starting to come through. You just have to go over 175 miles an hour for probably about a minute, and it'll get your five awesome speed skills. And that'll bring us to chapter four, Cut a Dash. The aforementioned eight paint colors that the 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 offers really make it shine. Give it a little love by painting the car's body and seeing what color suits it best. I do already have a paint on this, and if I do say so myself, it looks pretty good. This was made by a member on the channel, Mr. Gregory. Just tune into any of the streams, you'll see him in all of them. And, but unfortunately, we are going to have to take this paint off. Now, if you already have a paint applied or a livery applied, all you're going to have to do is come over here to Paint Car and pick any one you want. There's a lot more than eight here. Not sure where they got their, uh, their figure for the uh, eight of them. But we are just going to do nothing really fancy here. We're just going to pop on a different one. That will complete our chapter four. Thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you out. Y'all have a wonderful day.